Mm. It's tempting to try and put the red on the right hand side cushion, swing the cue ball back behind the black, something like that, but I don't really like that, not as a This red needs to slow down, and it did. There was a danger there, he could have left it potable past the yellow, but he's safe. There's a gap between the green and blue. He didn't play to hit the yellow. Can Dave Gilbert play side to side behind the black? Oh, he hit it thick. Has he got a snooker behind the blue? Is it going to hold up? <sighs> There's a gap between red and side cushion, but it's a lot more of an acute angle into the middle pocket than you would think. There it goes, though. Yeah, it looks a lot easier on the screen yeah. than it is actually on the table, but Dave Gilbert has given John Higgins the chance. If he drops the red in, you feel he's in the final. One. <laughs> And it looks as though that will cost him. John Higgins just needing the colour to get to snookers required. And you feel if he pots the colour, he'll be on the yellow. What a tremendous performance from Dave Gilbert. But just that safety shot, he decelerated on it. No way, he should have pushed it past the middle pocket. And the green one. Twenty-seven points in front. Twenty-seven Four. points remaining. Just the yellow required. Oh. He's been in the final the last two years. He's going to be in the final for the third time in a row. And that green confirms it. And there were times in this match when you really didn't think this was possible. In the second session yesterday, he came out and he was all at sea. Last night, he dug in and dug in. And Dave Gilbert will have nothing but admiration. He'll be upset. He thought it was a great chance to get to the final, but you cannot. 18. You cannot ever discount this man. What a tremendous performance and produced some tremendous snooker. Made the highest uh, 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 uh,